Welcome back to the channel, guys. It is me, AD744. So today, guys, we'll do a UEFA Nations League draw reaction. Uh, like I said, guys, I'm not going to really spend too much time here because it's just a reaction. Just give you guys my early thoughts, early takeaways. So for the purposes of this video, guys, I'm just going to go over which nation are the favorites to top the group and which nations are the favorites to get relegated, which nations potentially can get relegated. Just early predictions, guys. Early, early thoughts, you know, like not too concrete. Obviously, I, I, the games are going to start in September, so a lot of this is subject to change. So starting with Group A1, we got Croatia, Portugal, Poland, Scotland. I think my big early takeaway in this group is that Scotland is it's a tough group for Scotland. I think Scotland have been handed a very difficult group. But the thing is, like, I think Scotland can get something against Poland. I think Scotland-Poland is going to be a very interesting matchup. I think that's probably the best hope for Scotland to... Uh, not get directly rele relegated because I feel like, in my opinion, it's one of the two that's going to go down. Croatia, Portugal, they should be battling for top spot. And at this current moment, I think Portugal have a way better team than Croatia, but let's be real, Portugal's management is very suspect. And uh, you know, I just realized, guys. Oh, yeah, yeah, never mind, never mind. But yeah, I mean, uh, it's going to be interesting to see how this group pans out. But yeah, I mean, I, th I think that the top two and the bottom two is pretty clear. It's just a matter of how the ordering is going to go. Group A2, ooh, this is a difficult group. This is a hard group for Israel. Israel, I feel really bad for them. Um, I think this is a very difficult group for them. Israel might get just pimp slapped in all the games, potentially. And yeah, I mean, uh, as far as top spot is concerned, that's a difficult one because that can go any of the three. Like Italy, Belgium, France all have an argument to be first. I don't know, man. I don't know which team could be first this moment. I think at this current moment, I think the easy answer will probably be France. I think most people would probably pick France. But I could I, I wouldn't be surprised to see France don't top. You know, I wouldn't be surprised. But yeah, France are probably the favorites. Group A3, Netherlands, Hungary, Germany, Bosnia, Herzegovina. Bosnia, Herzegovina, this is a very difficult draw for them. They're probably it, it's too difficult for them. As for a top spot, Hungary could do something. Hungary could do something. They could top this group. I wouldn't be surprised. Because Germany, I'm not still sure. There's still a lot of issues about them, and Netherlands. They're a good team, but I don't know. I don't know if this. I don't think this Netherlands team is that amazing. So Hungary for me, they are def. They definitely have a strong argument to be made. Uh, then obviously Group A four man, Spain, Denmark, Switzerland, Serbia. Guys, this is a difficult. This is a group of death. Because, for me, there's a clear favorite in that group, which is Spain, of course. But that second place is going to be very interesting, between Denmark, Switzerland, and Serbia. I can't tell you guys who's getting second place at this current moment. I don't know. And what I'm really curious to see, which nations could go down? Because for me, one of the three is going to go down. I don't know which at the current moment. But man, that's going to be very interesting, guys. That's going to be very, very fascinating. Because this is a very interesting group, man. Very interesting group. And then as you can see right here, guys, they have the quarterfinals laid out. The group winner, runners up versus group winners. So I think there'll, there'll be another draw, of course, uh, later this year at November 2024. To basically figure out which nation is going to be playing against which. And yes, you can see right here. They have a bracket laid out. Anyways, let's move to League B1. We got Czech Republic, Ukraine, Albania, Georgia. This is a very interesting group. I I think this is another group of death. Because that's very difficult to call which team is going to top the group. Very difficult. And which team is going to get last. So, yeah, I, I think that's a very interesting group, guys. That's a very difficult group to call. I don't know who. I, I haven't even made. I haven't even decided which predictions yet. Group B2, England. Oh, my jeez. England should be able to kick walk that group. England, if England lose a game of this group, it's a disgrace. I know it's really crazy for me to say, but okay, let me just say this right now. England have to top. Anything less than top is embarrassing. Even if they get the second place, that's embarrassing. England have to top this group. No excuses. As for the second, that's a difficult one. That's a difficult one. That, that, that's tricky. That's tricky. Group B3, Austria, Norway, Slovenia, Kazakhstan. I think for this one, it's a very difficult one. I think this is another group of death. I, you know, I actually like in the League B groups more than the League A groups because this is more competitive. Group B4, Wales, Iceland, Montenegro, Turkey. Wow. Another insane group. This is another difficult group to call. Then group C1, Sweden, Azerbaijan, Slovakia, Estonia. Sweden, you better, better, better qualify. If Sweden don't qualify, it's a disgrace. It's an absolute disgrace. Uh, group C2, Romania, Kosovo, Cyprus, Lithuania, Gibraltar. Yeah, that'll be interesting, man. I mean, we, I think, I think top spot is pretty obvious, but it's gonna be interesting. The group C three: Luxembourg, Bulgaria, Northern Ireland, Belarus. Ooh, that's a good one. That's a good matchup. Good, good group there. Luxembourg are probably the favorites. Group C four: Armenia, Faroe Islands, North Macedonia, Latvia. That's an interesting one. That's an interesting one, man. Interesting one. 
Link D, we got Lithuania, Grabulture, Samaria, Liechtenstein, and then Moldova, Malta, and Andorra. So, yeah, man, those are my quick early thoughts on the draw, guys. Remember, guys, we're going to have our predictions video come out, I think, sometime in September of this year. So, that's when the first match is going to take place. So, like I said, guys, uh, please remember to like and subscribe, of course. And let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And, yeah, I'll see you guys later, man. Peace out.